I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a map of a school. I'm going to come right here in the middle and I'm going to put one finger and a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to go curve line down off the page on the left, come back to the dot, curve line down off the page on the right. I'm going to come a little bit over here on the left and I'm going to mimic, draw it again, that curve line. In the center, I'm going to draw a dotted line because this is the street in front of my school. Now, starting on the center part right here, I'm going to draw a straight line to the left. Come back to the middle, I'm going to draw a straight line to the right. I come up and I just draw a straight line all the way across off the page. Inside, I'm going to draw little straight lines going all the way across. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. This is the sidewalk in front of my school. Right next to my sidewalk, I'm going to draw a straight line down straight line across, little triangle one, little triangle two, little triangle three, little triangle four. This is north, this is south, this is east, this is west. That is my compass rose so I will know where I am going. Okay, come back to our sidewalk Let's do one finger above, put a dot, and from that dot we're going to draw a straight line, straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, straight line connect. This is my school office, okay? I come over to the right hand side and I'm going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, straight line, connect. Inside this space is my school nurse and my principal. 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 Okay. I come right next to this building and I draw a straight line down, straight line over, come back up to the top, straight line over, straight line down and connect. This is the auditorium. Auditorium. That's where we have our assemblies. Okay? Now I'm going to come back over here and I'm just going to draw one, two, three, four little straight lines. Come up to the left. One, two little straight lines. One, two, three, little straight lines. This is the flagpole in front of the school. This is the flagpole in front of the school and right here in this space I'm going to name my school. This is Maple Avenue School and it has grades kinder through fifth grade, K through five. All right. Now I'm going to come back over to my office and I'm going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, connect. I come back to that space, I draw a straight line out, straight line out, straight line, connect. This is first grade and this is kindergarten, kinder. Kinder has its own yard, so we're just going to draw a curved line and leave it floating. This is the kindergarten yard, so they don't go on the big yard. They go on the kinder yard. 
they also keep kinder and first grade closest to the office and the nurse and the principals because they're little and they can't walk as far. However, right here by first grade, we're going to draw a straight line up off the page, right next to it, straight line up off the page. Inside, little straight lines going all the way down. Now this is as if you were looking down on the school map. Okay? These are the stairs and right about here we're just going to go straight line curve line off the page jump over straight line curve line off the page. <coughs> over up here which you can't even see is the rest of the playground for the big kids playground. So you take the stairs down to the playground. Okay? Alright. Now, right over here I'm just going to go straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line connect. And I'm going to put a straight line in the center. This is boys, this is girls, and these are the bathrooms. There's more, but we're just going to list these as the bathrooms. Next to this, straight line, straight line across, straight line up, straight line over, connect. This is second grade. Second grade. Jump over, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. This is third grade. Okay. Now, over here by the auditorium, we're going to draw a big curve line, straight line over, and inside we're going to draw little rectangles. These are tables because this is the lunch area. Okay, these are tables, and this is the lunch area. And right in between here is the lunch line because, come on the right hand side, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, connect, leave a space, straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, connect. These two, bu two buildings are the cafeteria. Cafeteria. Okay? Now, Come above and over here, one, two, three straight lines connect. This is fifth grade and they're in a bungalow. They're down on the yard and they're in a bungalow. Bungalow. And jump over because straight line down, straight line off. This is fourth grade. This is a K through five school and this is a bungalow. They're down on the yard also. Bungalow. Okay? So you've got kinder first, second, third, fourth, fifth. Playground, stairs, office, nurse principal, flagpole, auditorium, cafeteria, sidewalk, and street. I think that's all. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my yellow and right above my black dotted line, I'm just going to put a little bit of yellow for the inside of my street. And then lightly, now we're all going to loop-de-loop -loop lightly the colors on this map. If you do it too dark, you get rid of all your details. We want to keep all of these little details. So we're going to lightly loop-de-loop. -loop. This is our street. And I'm using black very lightly. I take my brown again very lightly. I'm going to loop de loop. This is just to give us a little bit of color. Jump over, loop de loop the other side. Okay? I'm going to take my yellow back and I'm going to do the inside little rectangles of my sidewalk. Now, this school is an example of my school in California. And because the weather is pretty much nice where we are all the time, our schools are spread out. Some schools, though, in the Midwest, 
and on the East Coast, the weather isn't so great, so they have buildings. But this is a California school. I'm going to take my red and just do my compass rose little triangles. And you got to know what direction you're going, especially if you got picked to be the office monitor. I come over to my flag right here and I'm just going to add some little bit of red. Hit my blue. Add a little bit of blue. Okay? Alright. Now, naturally I forgot something. I'm going to take my black and I'm going to do curve lines, curve lines, curve lines, curve lines, curve lines. And you might go, what is that? That is my fence. I should have done that at the very beginning. Safety first. So now I'm going to take my purple and I'm just going to put a curve line next to my black line so that you can see the whole entire school is safe. Okay? Take your black, lightly loop-de-loop -loop your playground for the big kids over here and loop-de-loop -loop the kinder yard over here on the left. Not too dark. Okay, if the building is for everybody in the school. I'm taking my yellow green and I'm doing the inside with just a straight line. So everybody can go to the auditorium. Everybody's going to eat in the cafeteria. Everybody is going to sit at the tables. Everybody can go to the nurse and the principal. Everybody can go to the office. So these are all going to be yellow green lines and everybody can go on the yard even the little kids so we'll make these yellow green also okay all the way down and everybody can go to these bathrooms so these are yellow green also now if it's a grade level I'm using my orange and I'm doing the inside of my rectangles orange so here's kinder this is primary first and kinder. Here's second grade. Get that orange. Here's third. Here's the bungalows. That's fourth. And this is fifth. I think that's all. Looks like it to me. Maple Avenue School. Alright, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my Maple Avenue school map all colored in. I think everybody's school has the same things, but it might be put together a little differently. Okay, bye-bye.